Uh, Covestro is the global leader in the production of high-tech polymers. So our products and solutions go in a diverse number of applications, including uh, mobility and automotive, IT and electronics, medical devices, uh, etc. Um, but what makes uh, Covestro unique is the use of uh, the power of innovation to um, solve world's challenges such as uh, energy efficiency, uh, lightweight materials for mobility, uh, and this is where our products and solutions can, can contribute to, that, to those challenges. So the um, center of gravity in terms of uh, economic development is definitely shifting towards uh, this region, particularly in, in China and, and Hong Kong. And this is where uh, we see a lot of uh, innovation, we see a lot of development in a number of different segments and applications. And this is where um, the uh, industrial engineering and data analytics uh, is, is very critical to be able to support this new innovation and this trend towards digitalization. So um, Hong Kong and China in general is, is uh, seen as a hub for these developments and it's uh, really the right place to be um, at the right time to participate in this trend. So the, the key word is, uh, is balance. So we look for a good balance between um, uh, soft skills and, and hard skills. Uh, so when we talk about hard skills, we are looking for uh, analytical capabilities. Um, we're looking for problem solving um, uh, skills. Um, but what uh, usually tends to be overlooked is the uh, importance of uh, soft skills. Uh, and for that, it's uh, very important to have the right balance. And what we mean by soft skill is to have uh, uh, an innate curiosity, um, is to have the uh, very strong interpersonal skills to be able to work and communicate in a complex, diverse environment. And uh, last but not least is having the integrity, uh, which is very important to, uh, to get the job done. So um, what we see is the uh, trend towards digitalization is uh, accelerating uh, at a very fast pace. We not only see this in our day-to-day -day private lives, uh, but this is also having a profound effect on how we do business. Um, it's having an effect on how we deal with our customers um, in um, creating new channels for doing business, such as e-commerce. Um, it's having also an effect in how we interact uh, with our partners as well, which was not the case just a few years ago. Um, on a daily basis, we uh, generate as a company a tremendous um, number of data, um, whether it's coming from the production operations or it's coming from our R&D and technical laboratories or um, as well as from our supply chain operations. So the ability to use analytical and data analytics and tools to uh, make sense of this information and convert all of this data into information um, that allows us to make decisions in a, an effective and efficient way um, is, is very critical. And this is where um, having strong competencies in uh, industrial engineering and uh, data analytics becomes very critical, again, to translate all of this vast amounts of information or data that we receive every day into information that um, allows us to make better decisions. So the, the way we look at it is that the uh, AIDA curriculum um, provides a very strong foundation for the uh, students to develop their analytical skills, uh, to develop their capabilities and competencies in industrial engineering and uh, data analytics. So this alone provides a very good uh, foundation 
um, combined with some practical experience that uh, takes place with uh, interacting with companies, for example, and running projects, um, uh, provides an overall good foundation for students to be able to go into the workforce and to contribute to companies such as Covestro um, from day one and not have to go through sort of the long traditional learning curve. On the other hand, the fact that the university is sitting in a, um, in a, in a, in a location such as Hong Kong, which is uh, a me metropolis with a very diverse set of uh, people from different parts of the world, and with uh, companies of different um, segments and different industries also provides the students with uh, an enriched environment to be able to develop themselves and prepare themselves to contribute to a company such as Covestro. So uh, we are fortunate that we've had a, um, a long-standing relationship with uh, Hong Kong University of Science and Technology and particularly the AIDA department, where over the years we have uh, recruited um, a number of students. Uh, some of them are employed with our company, uh, having graduated from the undergraduate program as well as the uh, graduate program. Um, on the other hand, we also run a number of programs where we offer internships, uh, be it short-term or mid-term uh, internships. And this has really allowed us to have a good view on the, um, uh, the quality of the students that are coming into our organization, at the same time as providing an opportunity for the students to practice their learnings um, in real-life uh, projects and real-life examples. So I think I believe this collaboration uh, is working well and is a win-win for both sides. And uh, we hope that this will continue in the future because um, Covestro in Hong Kong is a, um, a regional hub where we have a number of different functions, be it in supply chain, be it in the commercial side, as well as in corporate functions, which provides a number of different opportunities and avenues for talented uh, employees to, to go into. So I can share with you a, a couple of examples where we have um, uh, you know, former students from the AIDA department who are working for us and leading very important projects. Uh, one of them is uh, leading a logistics network optimization for all of the region Asia Pacific. So this is gathering all of the data and information about our transportation modes, about our warehousing capabilities, uh, and trying to optimize the way we do our network within Asia Pacific. So that's one example. Another example we are running where uh, one of the former students is also leading an initiative on a global basis to uh, launch track and trace capability uh, to be able to, uh, you know, using GPS technology, be able to track and trace our uh, shipments to our customers anywhere uh, in the world. And uh, these are very exciting uh, initiatives that we are currently running that are led by former students from the Hong Kong University of Science and Technology.